I'm here in Gorham, Louisiana, where a tornado touched down, knocking down several trees on this property, including the one hitting this house. The homeowner was too distraught to go on camera with me, but she says when she went outside when the storm was the fiercest, it sounded like a freight train. The woman whose house was struck said that her daughter was in this travel trailer and that it lifted off the ground and then a tree fell on the trailer. The tornado snapped off the top of this tree and it landed 30 feet away. This chicken coop was tossed dozens of feet, striking several vehicles before landing on this car. Crews were out working to restore power to the area. The National Weather Service out of Shreveport dispatched a damage recovery team to assess the effects of the tornado in Gorham. The National Weather Service reported that tornado warnings hadn't been issued in much of the southeast since late June, but that all changed with these storms. They said the clash of cold Canadian air drilling into the south and lingering warm moist air over the Gulf of Mexico typically leads to more damaging thunderstorms from November to December. One storm chaser captured half dollar sized hail in Faraday, Louisiana. While the damage to the house is severe, this homeowner said she is glad that no one in her family was hurt. In Gorham, Joel Massey, ABC 31 News that works for you.